This fact file is on the three-spined stickleback. These distant relatives of the seahorse can reach lengths of up to 11 centimetres and a maximum weight of 10 grams. Sometimes called a prickleback, tiddler or sticky bag, they are often encountered when pond dipping. The flanks of these sticklebacks are quite bony, with scoots running down them instead of scales. Despite the name, it can have anywhere from zero to four spines on its back. It has large eyes, suited to its predatory nature, and changes colour depending if it's the breeding season, usually in the spring. Males develop a deep red throat for attracting a mate, with blue and green hints. It's unusual among British fish that they build a nest. They do this by sticking leaves and twigs together, with a kidney secretion called spigging. When the male sees a potential love interest, he erratically dances, then, once she's laid the eggs, the male takes full parental care of the fry. These fish are not fussy about where they live. From ditches, ponds, canals, rivers, and even the sea, they are very hardy and can live in quite poor quality water. Britain has two other species, the nine-spined stickleback, which is our smallest freshwater fish, the males going jet black instead of red in the breeding season, while the largest species is the 15-spined stickleback, a totally marine fish, often found in harbours and reaching sizes of 25 centimetres. Sticklebacks have short lifespans, mostly not living more than a year, and tend to die after spawning. Being highly adaptive, they aren't under threat, and widespread across the British Isles, and indeed found across most of the Northern Hemisphere, in Canada, America, Japan, and Russia to name a few. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And why not check out our other fact files here? Until next time, cheers.